YouTubers, Tech Girl, and today I'm here to show you guys the cursor effect in Camtasia Studio 7. I've been getting asked a lot ever since my uh, other tutorial, my latest, well, my last tutorial, which I have a little clip of on the screen somewhere. Uh, ever since that one where I used Camtasia Studio 7 and had the uh, random effects, I've been getting asked a lot how do I do this? So I decided to make a quick tutorial on that. So I already made a little sample video of it and I added it to the timeline. Now with Camtasia Studio 7 you actually can record your system audio. Not a lot of people actually realize that but it's really cool that Camtasia Studio allows you to do that now. So you can record your system audio, then you have your microphone audio, then you have your screen recording or you can just record your system audio. It's completely your choice. So what we're going to do is do a little cursor effect, so I'm going to move into a point of the video where I want a cursor effect. So what I'm going to do is go right here to cursor effect, if it's not there, then go to more, and it might be in your list. Most of the time it's just right there on the side. Let's scroll down a little bit. You want to make sure your mouse cursor is visible. You can choose the size of your cursor if you want it enormous. You can you choose any size you want. Let's just make it about that big. You can you can have a highlight effect. You can either highlight it, which is just a yellow little uh, somewhat circle around the cursor. A spotlight, which uh, just a spotlight around the cursor. Oops. And then you can magnify it. if you're if you don't want to zoom in for a certain part. Then you can just magnify it so it's easier for your viewers to view. So let's go ahead and go into Spotlight, shall we? And now you can choose your right and left click effects. For left, we're going to do range, which is that right there that you just saw. And for right, we're going to do warp. Um, there is ripple, which is just like dropping something in a petal of water. It's pretty cool. As you can see there, if you actually hover over and left click, I mean, my mouse, uh, there you guys can see, when you right click or left click, it'll show the effect on the screen in the preview button. Yeah. Left click now, let's go and turn that back to work. And then you also can have your sound effects. We're going to just do uh, mouse click in that sound, mouse click sounds. And this is how the laptop clips us. So we're going to do mouse click on both of them. And you're going to press add keyframe. You're also going to go to this depth value and make sure this is set. The highlight effect is set to none. And go back and say that. And now, after that, we're going to turn off the spotlight at a certain part of the video. Let's go to. Right there, scroll down to turn it off. So you press none and press add keyframe. And make sure you go back to make sure it didn't unclick like it did. For some reason, it does that. So now, if I play the video for you guys, start from the beginning there. This is a sample video, sample video, sample video, sample video. Green gun. It'll turn on and off just like that. Very professional video, really that right. easy. Bye. So yeah, that's basically it on this tutorial. You just uh, produce it any way you want to. Produce it to uh, YouTube, which you can do straight from Camtasia Studio 7, upload it straight to YouTube, which is a cool new feature Camtasia Studio 7 has. And that's just one of many new features Camtasia Studio 7 has. I'll try to make as many tutorials on this. I will uh, either write a blog review or make a video review of Camtasia Studio 7. So look for that in the near future. But for now, that's it. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to check out the social links and the description on me. And don't forget to check out my newest channel, 
for technology talks where I'll just be doing tech talk on that channel and that's also the channel for the WordPress blog so all that and more don't forget to check out the links in the description of the video thanks for watching and I'll see you guys later peace